And out on the western slope, we'll see highs in the 80s and 90s later today. Meanwhile, in the eastern plains, expect 70s for high temperatures. Here in Denver, we'll be a few degrees warmer than yesterday. That'll put us right around 80 for a high temperature. Fort Collins, Loveland, Greeley, all of our friends in northern Colorado expect upper 70s to around 80 degrees this morning or later today as well. Now, this morning, there is a few light rain showers that we're watching in northwest Colorado. Highway 13 from Craig to Meeker down to Rifle. Just enough uh, rain out that way to get the pavement wet. So again, we're watching that, but for most of the morning, we're going to be dry statewide. By lunchtime, we'll start to see a few thunderstorms develop in the mountains, and then after 2 or 3 p.m., those storms will make their way east across the urban corridor. By 6.30, 7 o'clock, most of the activity should be east of us out on the eastern plains, where some of the storms could be strong to severe. Talked about this at the top of the half hour. This is the third day in a row we're under a marginal threat for severe weather for not only Denver and the Front Range and the plains, but today it actually goes west all the way to the Continental Divide and a little beyond over into Summit County. Rather unusual for the severe weather outlook to go that far to the west. We're going to do this one more time tomorrow. Another round of showers and thunderstorms, including the threat for some heavy rain and possibly some hail. And then our attention turns to the heat. Today in Phoenix, 107 degrees because of a big ridge of high pressure that is going to slowly make its way up into Colorado. This thing is going to be sitting right on top of us for Friday and the weekend. That's going to mean temperatures in the 90s with full sunshine. I'm talking not a cloud in the sky by Friday and Saturday, even in the mountains. It's going to be completely dry. And wow, look at these temperatures. 94 Friday, the record's 95, and then we should make it to 95 on Saturday. It's going to be a toasty one for the Renaissance Festival down in Larkspur this weekend.